गुड मॉर्निंग अंकल बॉब गुड मॉर्निंग एम्बर एंड टिमी गुड मॉर्निंग अंकल बॉब आर यू गोइंग समेर ओह ये टिमी आई एम गोइंग टू द मार्केट टू सेल दीज एग्स कैन यू बोथ हेल्प मी इन काउंटिंग दीज एग्स श्योर अंकल बॉब टेल एस वॉट टू डू ओके बोथ ऑफ यू टेक वन बास्केट ईच काउंट द नंबर ऑफ एग्स एंड लेट मी नो Uncle, there are twelve eggs in this basket. And there are ten eggs in this basket. That's good. Now, can any one of you tell me how to find the total number of eggs? Oh yes. We have to add the number of eggs from the two baskets. That's right, Amber. So, how much is ten more than twelve? We have to add ten and twelve. Good, Timmy. So, what should be the answer? When we add ten and twelve, we get twenty-two. So there are twenty-two eggs in total. Good job Timmy you are right now let's see how to add them step wise first start adding the ones so two ones plus zero ones give two ones now let's start adding the tens so 110 plus 110 give two tens So we get 22 eggs. Now suppose I happen to accidentally break 6 eggs out of 22 eggs. Then how many will be left? That means 6 eggs should be subtracted or reduced from 22 eggs. So 6 subtracted from 22 gives 16. So we will be left with 16 eggs. Good job, Timmy. Now let's see how to subtract them stepwise. Let's start from the ones column, but we cannot subtract six from two, so we borrow. When we subtract six ones from twelve ones, we get six ones. Since there is no number to be subtracted from 110, we write it as it is. Okay kids, thank you for helping me count these eggs. Amber, I hope you have understood everything. Oh yes uncle, I have understood everything. We use the term more than for addition and the term less than for subtraction. Okay kids now let me see if you can help me with this I always keep a count of ducklings and chicks in my farm Can you both help me count them and find the total We are ready uncle Yes let's start counting them <laughs> Okay let's start from the chicken house Come on Timmy Let's start counting. There are 15 chicks. But where are the ducklings? They must be near the pond. Come, let's go there. Hey, they seem to be enjoying a lot. <laughs> yes, Amber. They like playing in the pond. Hmm. There are 7 ducklings, Uncle Bob. Okay. Now let's add the number of ducklings and chicks. So we have to add 15 chicks and 7 ducklings and that should be 22 Uncle Bob they are 22 in total. Good job Timmy. You are right. So 7 more than 15 gives 22. 
Amber, can you try adding it stepwise? Sure, Uncle Bob. Five ones and seven ones give twelve ones. So we write two under the ones column and carry over one. And next, we add one ten with the carried over one to get two tens. Very good, Amber. You both learn very fast. Oh, thanks, Uncle Bob. Hey, where are they going? They must be going to eat something. Hmm. Okay. Now suppose we take away four from the total twenty-two. How many are left? That means we have to subtract four from twenty-two, right, Uncle? Yes, dear. Okay. So twenty-two minus four gives eighteen. You are right, Timmy. Can you do the stepwise subtraction? We cannot subtract four from two, so we borrow. When we subtract four ones from twelve ones, we get eight ones. Since there is no number to be subtracted from one ten. We write it as it is. Good job, kids! You did a great job. Thanks, Mr. Bob. We had a great time. Thanks, Uncle. You are welcome, kids. Hey, friends! I really enjoyed the visit to Uncle Bob's farm. Let's quickly revise the important points. The basic term used for adding numbers is more than. Some of the terms for subtracting numbers are less than, reduced by, and take away. You can use these terms to understand the basic addition and subtraction.